Hi. What happened to Nick Avocado? Bro's in critical condition. He can't even open his eyes. Nick Avocado is the definition of a bag chaser. He literally got hit by a truck this morning on the way to McDonald's. And he's making another mukbang video instead of going to the hospital. You you gotta respect the hustle. Also, my fault if I sound kind of sick in this video. I, I think I'm literally dying right now. I probably have like 24 hours to live. I have a fever and all type of stuff. My, my throat is sore. I probably got monkey pox or something, but... So, I don't know if how much of allergies allergic I actually am to seafood but I clearly am a little bit allergic of seafood because this is what happened to my face I feel like something is squeezing my arm it's very uncomfortable and I have to stop so today we're gonna have something really healthy to flush out the seafood. Did I hear that correctly? The Nikocado avocado is gonna eat something healthy? This is too good to be true. His definition of healthy is definitely gonna be like four Big Macs with extra pickles on it so we can say there's vegetables and then like a Diet Coke. Also, the fact that he's just now discovering that he's allergic to seafood is honestly astonishing to me because I assume this man has literally tried every type of food that this world has to offer. Never mind, I just looked it up and he He's done like 30 seafood mukbangs. What's what's going on here, Nicholas? Maybe my getting hit by a truck theory is actually what happened because Nick Akato is sitting on a throne of lies. Now I did go to the bathroom, so it has already come out, but it's leaving some type of residue inside, something that I'm allergic to and it's not okay. Twin, we did not need to know that. That was some unnecessary information. I have a lot of pain right here. Like it's just bad. Like I feel like something's squeezing internally. I don't know what I'm gonna have to do. You know what I'm, I'm kind of craving Chinese food. But I'm also craving like carbs. Maybe, maybe I'll just get a bunch of noodles. But I just did noodles like, two days ago. I don't know what I'm eating today. I thought about Panda Express, but maybe I should have, I don't know, Burger King or something. I'm just craving food. I crave food all the time. I actually look kind of skinny from back here, don't I? Like, I kind of look mostly skinny. Nick Akato, we're friends, right? We can be honest with each other. We can keep it a buck fifty. Because I'm not going to lie, there's not a single angle that's going to make you look skinny. I'm not trying to sound fat phobic or sound like I'm fat shaming Nick Akato. I'm a Nick Akato avocado stan. But let's not lie to each other like the girls putting the hourglass emoji under Lizzo's TikToks. The angles aren't doing anything. <laughs> y'all weren't expecting some type of explanation because I, I don't know. He needs to be checked into a mental hospital or something and like w what is he even wearing? Is he trying to cosplay as an elephant or something? I'm guessing it's some type of oxygen thing to help him breathe because he has the literal health of a 90 year old smoker. Also, what happened to I'm gonna eat something healthy today? Is this Nick's definition of healthy? Because that meal looks to me like it would take at least three months off your life expectancy. Did y'all hear about that thing where like every time you eat a hot dog it apparently takes 30 minutes off your life. If that's true, then Nick Akato has literally a week to live. I identify as skinny. You guys, I've lost the script. I've lost the plot. I've lost my mind here. Lost we go. I'm speaking. I, I keep getting fat and I need this to brief at night and after lots of huffing and puffing because I just did a little dance for you. We have it plugged in and I'm getting air. It's not oxygen. I don't want to hear all those rumors. He needs oxygen. It's pressure air because my double chin chokes me at night and during the day because I can't even take a nap. I can't even lay on the couch. I'm so grateful to be in America. There's so many starving, starving peasants in the Did world. Did you call me? Did you call me? He just called poor people who starve because they can't afford food peasants. I'm not gonna lie, you might need to get canceled for this one, Nick. I mean, I think I'd genuinely rather starve than eat so much that I have to have a machine attached to my face just to breathe properly. He eats so much that he's had like three heart attacks on camera. I think starving would actually be better than this man's lifestyle. It's unbelievable. Bro is literally a personified Humpty Dumpty. I ordered this without cheese to, be, to make my peasants happy because I'll have so many hating peasants on 
my channel. Nick, you're getting fat. Nick, you need help. Nick, you eat too much cheese. I like cheese. Those aren't even haters. Those are people that want you to stay alive for more than like three years. If anything, the actual haters are the people that watch and support this type of content, these mukbang videos, because that's honestly just enabling and encouraging this type of behavior where he's eating a wildly unhealthy. Nick Akato. You're unhealthy. <laughs> Nick Akato. You're so unhealthy. I can hear you breathe from all the way over here. Nick Akato. When will you sort your life out? Peasants. Can you realistically and logistically call anyone else a peasant when you look like this? The lack of self-awareness from Nikocado Avocado is honestly unbelievable. I'm just mollywopped and, and gobsmacked and bewildered at the fact that he's mocking people like me who just want him to be healthy. Just comment the word healthy if you want Nick to stop eating like this because he needs some serious help. You guys, thank you for watching. I will see you tomorrow because we never stop. I will never stop. I will never stop. The only way I'm stopping is when I... Uh, that, that wasn't me. He literally just cut off the video mid-sentence.